Greetings, my friends. I'm, of course, Elder Mocha Lover, and thank you for rejoining me here in Old World Blues, playing as New Canaan. And now, last time, we had a little bit of a religious disagreement with the 80s, we'll call it. But now they see the error of their ways, and they have repented. Now we have one big ol' happy Mormon alliance, including the Lord's Anointed, the Lone Tree Apostles, and the Sorrows Apostles as well. But let us continue doing a focus in our focus tree. So, I think we're going to go ahead and cement our control over Deseret and get down there as fast as possible. So, old practices for new times. It would be wrong to claim we had it easy in the past, but we certainly had it better than this. Much has changed between now and life before the Great Wall, but the change is not meant we should abandon the old wisdom of the Church. We should restructure ourselves drastically, or dramatically, to bring us closer to the Lord. We get Old World Blues, more political power gains, 20%, wow. More non-core manpower, a group of population factor, more research speed, Less master impact, which kind of sucks, I think. And then less damage to garrisons. Get with the program, old man. Well, I don't know how old Daniel really is, but I think he's still okay. You're going to get 1.47 a day. We're not going to do that. We're not going to do Matthew Green. M maybe we will, but we'll see what happens. God's Warrior, which I actually like. I'll probably go with that for less stability and more attack. Less stability. Well, if I want to do stability, I think God's Warrior is always pretty useful to take. So let's grab that. In... I don't want this political power gain, you know what? Uh, we can't do that one. We can't do that one. And we. Kaiser's right hand man? Well, we can't do that one either. So, instead, we might as well choose him and then continue building up our stability once again. Just fire World Goes Times goes upon us. Go and do that. Lose a little bit more stability. Oh, wait. Wait, we got. Oh, he gave us stability. We lost war support. Oh. Oh, my bad. I wasn't thinking there. My bad. Oh, well. What happens, happens. That's no, okay. That's really okay. But we do need to comment on this. I do want to go down that focus tree as fast as possible, just because, well, Volpus is fighting the Republic, the NCR. And, obviously, the NCR is winning so far. I mean, they still have a, quite a bit of manpower. The NCR has actually a little bit less in terms of divisions, 80 to 111, which is not bad for Volpus, of all people. But the NCR is quite a bit more, and then they also have the allies of New Reno, even though... Actually, New Reno has quite a bit of manpower. I didn't think they'd be able to hold on to all that. That's okay. New Klamath, Vault City... NCR Rangers, which, actually, these guys are all looking pretty darn weak, actually. Oh my gosh, look at all that. Look at all that resistance. That is terrible. But that's great for us to see. Uh, next up, we're pretty much done with the plain stuff. We, uh, let's grab that one. I like giving a little bit more range for our guys. That's a pretty good idea. And we're still mobilizing a little bit more. Two-year conscription and a civilian draft. Every man, woman, and child must learn how to shoot a gun, which is a good thing. A very, very good thing. They shoot for Christ. Gun it for Jesus. Right, come over here and do that. So, get with the pr program, old man. The church is backwards and bureaucratic. It refuses to accept much needed reform, much to the frustration of Daniel and his closest advisors. As a result, we have decided to fight back against these remnants of an ignorant age and have today sent out a list of our demands to every congregation in New Canaan and our tribal allies. We anticipated that the demands won't go down well with some of our congregations, but we were not expecting such quite an uproar. Some congregations have even taken up our arms against our leadership, declaring us heretics, and have pledged to remove us from leadership by any means necessary. It seems we have to fight our, for our to fight for our desperately needed reforms. Elements of the army anointed by reforms to take action against Daniels. Oh, there's a civil war. Oh, I guess we get a civil war schism in the church. Okay, reform the Mormon church. Anointed to declare war on the anointed. Everyone is killing each other. Oh my goodness. Ah, oh, Vault 24, how expected. Well then, oh good god, this is not good. Um. Hmm. Wow. Oh, that's that. That really sucks. <laughs> Look at them. They're stuck over there. That's funny. Uh, yeah. This is not good. I really wasn't expecting this, but that's okay because we're almost cut off from our divisions, from our supply depot, which really sucks. You know what? The best thing we could do is probably cut off these guys as fast as possible, and be led by Joshua Graham, of course, and then you guys would be led by someone else down here. Help. Take out these guys as fast as possible as well. And we shall do 3 3 3 2 2 2 2 2 attack. And I'll go with Alfred. And they should be led by who? Matthew Bates. Well, at least he came back to be a field marshal. Good, good, good. I didn't realize we were going to be in a civil war. Let's see what happens, though. Actually, loyalty among the clergy. Oh, loyalists among the clergy. A coup's strength. Oh, should have done that. Oh, local sheriffs. Oh, well. Whatever. Gaining core over every state. Cool. So, the new Theocracy of Deseret, composed of Utah in its entirety, has quickly become devoted to the word of the Lord. We must ensure all of Utah follows our commands for the safety of the congregation as a whole. Yeah, that'd probably be good. At least we still got our puppets, and Daniel's still leading. 
Uh, conflicted industrialists, we don't really need that. So, go right ahead when you can. Hopefully they didn't get too many planes, which is not good. I'm going to go ahead and take you guys off. Mm. I'm going to send you down here first, so that we can just win down here quickly. Move, 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 move. we got to get in here and destroy them all. And call all of our allies in. There's no peace. There can't be peace with these people. Get down here as fast as you possibly can. You have to break through, Kanab. And then, they're probably going to... Uh, let's see, you guys, actually... I'm going to have to make some sort of, like, last stand here, so... You guys are actually going to be separated. And Jesse Morgan. Uh, we're going to grab this guy. One, two... Uh, there we go. Followed up with a right there. Cool. Good luck, guys. You're going to need it. Sniper. Uh, you can do entrench stuff. And land night attack. That sounds pretty good to me. Yeah. You got to move, 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 move. We got to make sure that our puppets are okay. At least some of them. We don't have to save all of them. But at least most of them should be okay. And grab some of that. That's fine as well. It's fine. These divisions probably aren't as good as ours, so I'm not too worried about this. I'm worried about this group here, though. Get Patch Gulch. Come on, come on. The less enemies we have to kill, the better. Uh, yeah, that'd be probably pretty good. You guys. Doing a pretty, pretty decent job, probably. Oh, even the Grand Tribes are suffering a little bit. That's fine, though. Good. Hey, we can circle a couple guys here. Good. And then go down here. Hopefully we don't get capitulated, so I'm going to have you guys come up this way. And then hopefully we can get up here quickly and capitulate Vault 24, hopefully. Grand Tribes are gone, so be it, so be it. Come on, beat them up, beat them up. It's a slight civil war, that's all it is. A slight civil war. These guys are completely cut off, which is awesome. You guys sit over here, and then do that, do that. Oh god, it's just fine. Sky Reavers, what? We don't have time for this. I'm sorry, but we don't have time for that, so get out of my face. Uh, let's see. Technology, climb down on autonomy. We could do that eventually, but now nah. Let's do that one. Convert them? I mean, if they just join us, that's fine with me. Okay, sure, why not? Why not? Let's see what happens, right? Just see what happens. Uh, oh, we cannot have these guys ruined just because we don't have a close enough airbase down here. Come on, push, 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 push. Don't let them come up to New Canaan. We might have to get our own soldiers, or puppet soldiers, and bring these guys back. Oh, we saved the Tar Walkers for now. Good. Get some better doggos, because the doggos are amazing. I really was not expecting a very violent civil war at this time. I'll be honest. <laughs> this was the, one of the last things on my mind that we had to do for this campaign, is a civil war. But, you know what? It is what it is. Uh, you don't have time to rest. You got legs. The Lord bless you with a good amount of legs. So, uh, yeah, get over, get over here, this way. Oh god, look at them. Even the Lord's anointed. I love that we took over almost all of Utah, and then all this is, re is a result of what happened. Hey, we did it down here, great! That's exactly what we want to see. Um, if that's the case, I'm gonna actually put you guys here-ish. Who is this? This is the White Legs version. So basically, we're helping everyone but ourselves first. Which we are on a ticking time bomb. That should be enough to hold up there, but we'll see what happens. Get to Vault 24, good. You already got the new Nephi, good. And this is actually our own territory, which is awesome. Right? This is, yep, this is ours, good. Now, where's the capital? Payson? You gotta come to Payson. Oh, this is got guys in there. Hey! New Canaan's capitulated. There we go, my friends. That was, a, that was probably one of the quickest civil wars I've ever had. And that we've actually done well. We did so, we did it so quickly that we might be prepared for a potential war against the Sky Reavers. Now that is pretty good gaming, if you think so. I think so. I think that's awesome. Pretty good gaming. Hmm. Hmm. Cool. Do that. Awesome. Just awesome. Well, we lost a couple guys, which means we got to raise a bigger army now. That's really quite unfortunate. All we had to capitulate was the other new Canaan, the evil one, the old, out with the old, in with the new. Uh, you know, I can still go down with upgrades, it's fine. We did lose some manpower, so be it. We actually, oh, wait, oh, are we still puppeting, converting them? Are they not? I like them blue, they already are puppets, so, well, whatever, that's fine. 
Wow, we won within 10 minutes. Not bad. Not bad, I'd say. Not bad at all. Uh, Dr. Ground falls ill, but that's okay. You know, I think he kind of deserves a little bit of a rest right now. Ooh. I think everyone kind of does. Alright, come on. Did you think we're going to be that weak, guys? Come on. The NCR won't help you if you attack me. But if I attack you, then they'll help you. Actually, all these people will attack us. I don't know. Should we take out the NCR in this campaign? Let me know in the comments below. They're looking pretty darn thick. But they're still not doing that well against Volpus. I do want to take out Volpus' Legion to get all the lands from Utah and under one, you know, honeycomb. But we'll see what happens. Gain a core in every state. Any puppet that is completely in Utah will be annexed. Any Utah states owned by puppets not completely in Utah will also be annexed. So we'll see what happens. I might just go to war with the Volpus' Legion as well. So we'll see what happens. Hopefully it'll be good. And we get a lot of divisions. Look at all that naval XP. Air XP. Army XP. Good, good. Oh, I forgot about you guys. I always forget about the Spec Ops. It's alright. We still love them. Shift over just a little bit. Make some room. You guys are headed down, which is good. Good, good, good. 1.69. Nice. Uh, so I can't do anything there. That's fine. And cement all control. Good. Cultivate Mormon settlements. Ooh, I like that. Less political power, but give more stability, war support, a people's church, democracy. Ooh, ooh, that's not bad. More religious immigrants, a people's church. We, the clergy, are more mere conduits between our congregations and the Lord. By involving all of our people in the church, we shall bring cohesion to the land. Or our land. Um. Wait, did I just annex somebody? I annexed all of the White Legs divisions, except they are still down here. Uh, okay. Alright, do we get these as we do get these as core, so I mean that manpower is looking pretty darn nice now, I'd say, but still. We got plenty of water, plenty of scrap, just in case. Get some more of this, I guess, for now. Special forces, sure, why not? Cool. Anything else here? Not really. So we got these extra divisions. I'm just gonna convert all these guys to normal infantry. Tribal faithful. There we go. Split them down, twelve, there you go. Nine, there you go. Ah, three, very good. Hey, perfect. That's almost perfect for us. Come on, guys. Don't you want to go to war? Okay, so they did go to war. Oh, Mountain Hawk is gone now. Oh, that sucks. Wait, Mountain. Oh, he was up here. Lord's Teacher, less stability. Oh. Oh, we annexed the Tar Walkers as well. Sorry, I didn't even realize them, that they were gone. Oh, and the 80s still exist because they still own non-Utah territory. That makes sense. Saws? Uh, sure. Sure, why not? Uh, let's see. Mormons. We're probably going to go with miniguns. Minigun Mormons. I like that idea. It's fine. You can join the war, too. So, basically, we took over all areas that are part of Utah. That's why the White Legs still technically exist. Because, well, they're not part of Utah. Oh, my goodness. Just trash them. I don't want to see all this extra stuff. Oh, we got actually another fleet as well. Not bad. Even though we'll probably never use it. Let's fill out our other planes and ships. Oh my goodness. Can you guys actually all link up together? That'd be great. There you go. Don't have to worry about you. Interesting. So this is part of Arizona? Yeah. Interesting. I gotta go to Utah and Arizona someday. I really do. Oh, they're actually spreading down here. That's not good. Scavenger Triumph, nice, good. It's a mighty step into the future. Uh, we got here getting paid soon, nice. Exploit people? Oh, uh, can help all the settlements and then climb down on autonomy for now. Beautiful. Oh, we even. Oh, I didn't even realize it, but we got the Lone Trees and the Lord's Anointed. Uh, oh, hold on, we didn't get Murtal Ah, huh. oh, and they're allied to other people, I see. Oh, they don't like the good word of the Lord, I see. Huh. What a bunch of sinners. Well, we gotta put them where God would want them. On their knees. Let's see. Gliders, very good. Good. And that's enough for now. Give him a few more seconds to just, uh, just go ahead. You should have very few problems doing this. 
Uh, you might not win everywhere, but that's okay. Things happen. Some new doggos, yes please. Make some saws as well if you do have the strength for it. I love new Canaan. Do we get the decision to form Deseret? Probably we do. We'll see what happens. And we should probably also get just five war goals, yeah. Nice. Very good. Losses, 600 some versus 2,000. Not bad. I wish it was a little, wish it was a little better, but that's okay. That's okay. Desert Pass, cool. And I have my holy brew of darkness here to join us. Now, I did do this before. I did say this. Any state that's not in Utah, we're just going to pop it. I'd love to own them directly, but... That's okay for now. Ooh, they still got a little bit of resistance. Oh, wait. Did I annex them? Oh, maybe I did. Uh, let's see, where this nation. There you go. And to help reduce lag, I'm just gonna give this back to them as well. Because they did take them over earlier, so. There you go. Now, is it an occupied state? They can probably deal with that, right? I don't wanna just core for them for free, so. That wouldn't be very good. Ooh, Darius Will. Looking kinda cool. Beloved personality. 3,000 manpower for now, no divisions, makes sense. What do we have here? Updated equipment and production strip. Broken masks, good. Now let's everyone let's hit up north and have a good time up there. Oh, the Vulpus, Vulpus's Legion is actually coming back. They're still fighting the Vegas people, but hmm. Actually, for now I'm gonna come back and do this. Uh, looks like we need another, another new commander. If I knew that, I would have promoted more people. Lewis Reynolds. Anything here? Sniper, observant leader. There we go. There we go. They might come through here, but whatever, I don't really care. And then Vulpus's Legion. Cool. Not bad. Not bad, I'd say. Newest or Nomads, Camel Survivalist. Very good, very good. Well, the Mormon Alliance just keeps getting bigger. Vulpus is... Oh! Ah, oh, that's why they're not doing as well now. Ah, Vulpus actually... Turn the tables and had these guys, the Paz Bandits, come back alive. Oh, that's not good, though. That's a lot of resistance. Holy cow. Yeah, I'd imagine that you'd have no manpower. Vegas? How's Vegas doing? Oh, they got a lot of resistance as well. Oh, but they got enough manpower for now. Good for them. Good for them. Oh, crap. Hold on. We can't go to war just yet. They're guaranteed by High Chapel. I don't like that. So, we gotta do this then. High Chapel, I can't imagine it would have a ton of manpower either. But you know what? I could be wrong. Reorganize ourselves just a little bit. Uh, make sure we got a few air bases here and there. Like, drop one there. Drop another one there. Drop one over here. Just because... And drop another one there. Because we can. Uh, radar. People's Church. Good. I love the People's Church. This is why I started building up some of the roads in our, in our puppets. Because, well, we could use them. See? Exactly. A People's Church. Oh, squad automatic rifles. I love it. I love it. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Scavenge the vaults. Grand tribes. Trade flourishes. Elite basic weaponry. We can wait on that. So, breach to the masses. All of the people of our lands and greater wastelands deserve to hear the word of the word of God. We must send people far and wide to preach to them, as well as setting up radio towers dedicated to spreading the Lord's message. I think that'd be right. A great thing. Good. Give them a few more seconds and then we will uh, head out, shall we? We need more casts though, and close air support. Oh, that's what I thought. Good. Nice. Oh, well, keep doing that, stop doing that. There we go, composite rams, nice, cool, don't really need them. That's okay though. This is not a full waste on conquest, let's go to war. And I knew they attacked me. Actually, call all of our allies in. That'd be fine. Well, we're gonna get one big old puppet on High Chapel up here. That's very nice. Even though they, uh, I might have Heaven's Gate actually instead because they have no more manpower. Yeah, probably Heaven's Gate. Uh, let's see. Good, better doggos. Even the best doggos. Uh, do you guys not have any? Oh, you probably don't have any planes. That makes sense. They are spreading through here, which is not good. So go right ahead. 
Not everyone's gonna win yet, but that's okay. You guys, honestly, with the way their country's looking, I'm not too worried about this. They have, like, no manpower, so the damage we do now... Well, it's gonna be a lot of damage we do forever. Inspirational good. Grab. Inspirational. If you wanna read this, go right ahead. Freedom of Liberty, if this happens pretty much any game, uh, it's nothing. Just do that. That's fine for now. Oh, we got another upgrade, too. Mission flying. Get more attack. It's fine. Good. Five research slots. You gotta love it, man. You really gotta love it. So far, I'd say we're being pretty darn successful. We've lost 200, 300 some guys. Versus 1,500. Not bad. Oh. And settlements. Lovely. 6% war support. Not super lovely. <laughs> uh, we probably want to climb down on autonomy for now. That's fine. Almost 8,000 manpower. What a beautiful thing. Go ahead and take these guys out as well. Oh, crap. You just got encircled. Oh, my goodness. Are you big dum-dums? Yes, you are. You are incredibly stupid. Alright. That means I've got to rescue them immediately. Wow. I can't believe you actually did that. Are you stupid, AI? Yes. Yes, they are. Very much so. We host the Grand Tribes in Exile Government. Okay, then. Like, move your booties down here, because that was that is stupid. That is one of the dumbest moves I've ever seen the AI do for us. And I, I'm not prepared to lose all these guys. I'm sorry, but I'm not. Come on, come on, get down here. Move, move, move. Come on, Spec Ops, you gotta help these morons out. I can't believe they decided to get themselves completely encircled. Good. Reach for the masses. Because as it shows, the masses can't be trusted. They get themselves completely encircled sometimes. Why do you take so why do you take so long? Why do you take so long? Come on. We, there's literally thousands of men here who are going to die if you don't do anything about this. Get in the battle, move. Jesus. Oh my goodness. Come on, man. Demos moves I've ever seen the AI do. Leonida. Very cool. Preach to the masses. Inspirational. Very good. Local leader. Yes, please. And we shall do... Cultivate Mormon settlements. By encouraging devoted Mormons to settle in the far reaches of our lands, we shall encourage the faithful to spread and allow local commerce to thrive once again. Six more civilian factories that sound very good to me. We'll grab some of that, perhaps. Come on. You have... You ha There's no excuse for you to not break through here. It's literally a matter of life or death for these soldiers. And while they probably honestly don't deserve to... Move around. You just saw. Yeah, we're gonna lose. We're gonna lose an army. We're gonna lose an army because the AI is stupid. Because the AI is beyond stupid. They. I lost them all. I lost all these soldiers because the AI got in somebody. It's not my fault. No, 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 no. That is beyond redemption. I'm sorry, but at this point, we're gonna have to read the Bible a little bit more closely and uh, have a few slaves of our own. Yeah, that is ridiculous. Have you ever? Have you ever had something like that happen in your campaigns? If you play Hoi Four, like. You set them off to do well. You tell them to just go attack. And then every single one of those divisions moves out to go ahead and attack. You know what? That wasn't worth it. That wasn't worth it all. I'm just going to straight up annex you. That was not worth it. Holy cow. You? Jesse Morgan? Yeah, you're done. I'm not, I'm not using you. I'm not going to have you as an army leader. Give all your divisions to this group. That is pathetic. There's no way you'd be that incompetent. But apparently you are. Oh, my goodness. The Lord... He, he likes to forgive, but there's some sins that he just cannot forgive. Oh my gosh. Like, holy crap. You just lost 21 divisions. Mm -mm. This episode has been a roller coaster of emotions, man. First we have civil war, then we have incompetence. Or maybe he was just a traitor in the army. I don't know. But sending every single one of those guys out to literally the single spot? A single spot? No, no. That's not what we do here. Scam just found nothing, that's okay. Uh, I really don't care about technology right now anymore. It really doesn't matter too much. We already have whatever we, we need, so. If we develop more stuff, that's totally fine, but, you know. Air doctrine stuff. The AI doesn't really use air doctrines. Um, is there a way to burn the new, new New Jerusalem? Because uh, these guys need to be taught a lesson. I actually, I said I wasn't going to do this, but I'm probably just going to straight up annex High Chapel. They need to be taught a lesson. I will liberate and puppet Heaven's Gate, though. 
Come on, guys. Come on. They literally have no more manpower. They, they're they not that strong. Yeah, they're getting group of population. But that's nothing. That's literally nothing. Oh, man. Why is my CP so low? We only get 0.12. Ah, war support so low. That's why. Alright. Come on. Well, you're either going to attack or die. Like... That those are your only two options. Uh, where are you guys at? Good. Yeah, I don't understand how these guys can get more manpower when they basically have none already. Uh, it make, doesn't make sense. But a mission fulfilled. For many months, Daniel has roamed the Utah ways, pre preaching to all those who will listen to his pious words. Now, at last, Utah has seen the light of the Lord, and so Daniel is content to rest his weary feet for a little bit. A little bit. Uh, we're done pretty much there. I think we're pretty much done here as well. Uh, get some of that. That's fine. Since we're doing this already, do that as well. Good. Maintenance companies, good. Even though we're not releasing them. It's okay, though. Yeah, I'm sorry, but I don't think that's really fair doing recruitable population stuff as soon as we go to war. Yeah, I don't think so. You know what? I never use Beloved Leader, but we're going to grab it as soon as we can. Uh, and they're all cut off. Good. Oh, there goes the Fall of Shady Sands. Interesting, very interesting. Uh-oh. Oh, Vulpus might just annex them. Now, I was not expecting this. Yeah, they did. Wow, look at that. Oh my goodness, that is disgusting. Climate's still fighting independently? Oh my goodness. Yeah, I would, did not want to do this, but... Yeah, you don't deserve jack squat, High Chapel. You are going to be taught a lesson, and you know the Lord may forgive, but I'm going to have to ask for a lot of forgiveness for what I'm about to do to them. Mm. And now we're completely surrounded by Volpus's Legion, which could be a worse thing. They don't. They oh, never mind. They have a lot of divisions. Yeah, we can't go to war with them yet because we need way more divisions because we lost way too many guys because of incompetence. I hate it when the AI is so incompetent. I love it when they're incompetent when they're fighting me, but we could use power armor, but we already have spec ops, so I'm going to keep doing this. Come on. Oh my goodness. How many divisions did they make? Too many. That's a correct answer. So let time go on, and I'll figure out what we're going to do. We could clamp down on time. I'm going to core these states, but... Hmm. Keep doing that. That's good. That's good. That's good. Uh, can we go to war with anyone else besides Vulpus' Legion? Because he's got too many states for me to do anything about that for now. The way he divided this up is really disgusting. Excuse me, disgusting though. You know what? I don't like seeing borders like this. So instead... I'm going to fix the border gore here a little bit. Don't want to forget the islands though. Transfer it over. Uh, that's, that's okay for now. I'll give him that. Give him this as well. Uh, are there any other spots here that Paz should not own? Actually, that looks pretty good, actually. So, I'm feeling pretty good about that. We could go to war with the old country and them up there, but we need a little bit more manpower. Let's see if we can get some more. Yes, we can. Good. Layered air conscription. Good. Good, good. I was sort of hoping that this episode would be, would be the last, but apparently it will not be because we cannot fight Vulpus's Legion just yet. The way to get over to all this is through Vulpus's Legion, which is going to take a at least one more episode, because we just don't have it right now. Um, we need more resources, but we can't trade. I'm probably going to have to decrease opening to traders. That's probably what we're going to have to do as well. But it gives us time to get maybe some tanks. So let's take a look. A look-see, shall we? Let's see. You and me, a mission fulfilled. We'll talk about that in a little bit. That is one war going on. Legion Klamath, 2,000 versus 11,000. Jesus Christ, Klamath, come on. Um, arm the caravanners. Naval dockyards, scavenge the vaults. We can probably do that first. So, vaults, both from vault Tech or the pre-war government, litter the wasteland. Many are hidden, and most are well-guarded, but with enough effort, we should be able to exploit them for resources. A good thing. A very, very good thing. Uh, let's see. Can we build up any more planes? That is what we're going to need for this war. We need more resources, which we are getting, but we need more... Uh, I guess vehicles would be very nice. But we need more resources, political power to get more resources. That's right. Yeah, that's good. Because I do want to maybe get some tanks. I think tanks would be nice. I, I almost never make tanks. So I figured, you know what? Let's get some tanks. Power armor scavengers? Good idea. What are we building? Let's build ourselves up a little bit more as well. Build tons of civilian factories. Good. And build one more right there. 
Oh, right here. Alt 24. I love Alt 24. Ah, former divisions? Good. Yeah, we're gonna need such a huge army, it's not even funny. Mm hmm. Because now we have, well, some of this. By the way, we have all this. Actually, we probably don't even have to call in the 80s then. You know what? Let's not call in the 80s. It'll just be us and them. If that's the case, then we actually have a pretty good shot of doing pretty darn well. I will call in the Sorrow so that we can do that. I will call in you guys as well because you guys will hold there probably pretty decently. Split you guys in half and then come right there as well. Nice. And maybe we can drain the enemy's resources on us so that we can it's pretty easy. Corruption. Continue to root out corruption. Corruption is never a good thing. And then four Spec Ops Division should be able to hold out pretty decently right there. That being said, we're going to need some air bases. Mexico's on fire. Good to do that. Radar would always be nice to have. Always good to have. Uh, yeah, look at all this. Oh, look at all this. This is nice. Good. So I remember one of the comments from yesterday was saying that, you know, we went to war with the 80s. What we could have done instead of doing that was instead of killing them, like, do, take that option where they wanted to talk. We could have done that. Someone recommended that it might have been cool if we did that. Eh, but, you know, maybe next time. If we get the option next time, hopefully we will. At least I remember we will. So, good. Yeah, we're almost done there. Nice. All right. Uh, let's grab that. Vehicles. Scavenge car. I guess we might as well, right? Cool. Promote caravan companies. Yeah, as much as I, like I said, I love the research speed and everything else. We're going to need a few more resources for ourselves first. And let's arm the caravans. Despite our best effort, our soldiers can't be everywhere at once. If we arm our caravans, we, they shall be safe. They shall stay safe. Better yet, we may advance our knowledge of every weapon as a result. Good. Good, good, good. Get these guys over here. We'll go to war whenever we really feel like it. I don't think people will really care too much. Climate is actually doing okay still, though. They're still doing okay. They have a recruitable population factor, maintenance efficiency. Good. We're gonna need that for tanks. Nice. You guys are still training. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, that definitely helped out our circuitry so we can make more planes. That is, oh, that is so nice. I gotta find other words other than nice. What other words should I say instead of just nice? Like nice all the time. Like awesome. I say cool a lot as well. But nice, so generic, so generic. I gotta say something. A little more special, I guess. Motorcycles. Uh, you know what? We could probably start making some of those. We only need really one on here, so. That'll be bueno. Keep building up, keep building up. That'll be great. Uh, a couple divisions I see up there. Oh, can we lower the autonomy of someone? How much political power do we get? Almost two a day. That's awesome. Ah, uh, Grand Tribes. I love it. They are a child in faith. Good. We're building ourselves up very nicely. Ah, scavengers during trumpet. Time for some new world hopes. Oh, oh, we can build factories faster. Actually, that's perfect. Uh, how is... Volpus has done extremely well for himself. Like, all that extra manpower. Look at those factories. His double, our factory count. All those divisions. Uh, oh, they're fighting against the banditos. Oh, that is not going to be good for the banditos. They should have, like, no manpower. They have 30, 40 divisions. They have a little bit. They have a little bit. So I'm not going to call anyone in except for the Sorrows. But no, I can't call in the Sorrows. You know why? Because they'll call in the other allies, which will get screwed over. So, that's good to remember. That's actually very, very good to remember. Because they will call in other allies here. So, uno dos. Thank you. So now we actually have a few extra divisions to throw around. Um, Do we have... Yeah, we do own slots right here, which is fine. I'm actually... I'm really glad I remembered that. Ooh. That could have been so bad. Mm -hmm. Good, and we're going to throw one, two, three. Three should be enough right there, right? Silver waterway. Oh, actually, I could have just sent another army that way. Oh, well. On the caravans, and then we shall do what? Uh, aid the tribes? Sure, why not? Let us preach them, to them, practical skills for this life, and we shall prepare them for what's to come. A grand idea. If so, mobilizing, we can probably cut it down just by a little bit more. There we go. That's a little better. Canaanite militia. 
Hope we're not using any of that. Yeah, we're not. Good. Rain of sufficiency. Good. Good. Alright, let's stop training. Stop training and get ready to go to war again. A little bit more of a struggle, shall we? Oh, wow, look at that. They're looking a little weak in some areas. That resistance is going, getting up higher and higher, which I love to see. How's resistance all over the place? Actually, we have Christians in action. It's the CIA. I should have done more of this earlier. Ooh, that's okay, though. Oh, uh, look at... Oh, my gosh. 86%. 40% compliance. Is it going up? It should be, right? Nope, compliance gain is disabled. 87. God dang. Construction repair. They probably want to do resistance, not construction repair, but that's just me, so... Now they'll probably find a hole in which uh, they can attack me from. But we'll see what happens. Ah, they're going to attack us over there. That's fine. They're attacking us over here. That's fine as well. Nope. Uh, we're, we, can't, we just can't call anyone in just yet. Um, how about you guys? I will actually have you guys push immediately, though. Because they don't seem very strong over here. And these are our cores, right? They should be our cores, as well as the 80s cores. So that should be okay. As long as I don't call anyone in, we'll be bueno. Sorry guys, I know you want to help us out. I know you do, but this is this is a fight we gotta take for ourselves. We must soldier on and bear our own cross for this. You know what, you guys could probably actually do well as well. There you go, nice. Alright, who else is uh, would like to get uh, a convert? No, a child in faith. Oh, we actually built all that stuff up pretty quickly. Nice, go ahead and do that as well. Maybe somewhere like here? Sure, why not? We might not need it, but that's okay. Vulpus. 302 factors, not bad. Do we have resistance here? No. And that is one of the greatest things about coring Utah. I love Utah. God, I really have, I have to go to Utah someday. Rubber refinement, nice. Ah, oh, yes. What I've been waiting for. Scrap gun trucks. Because... No, thank you. There you go. I want some scrap gun trucks so we can make use those with tanks, maybe. Yeah, I definitely won't be able to kill off the Legion in this episode, and that's fine with me. That is fine, 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 fine with me. We'll get down here too, so. Aid the tribes, educate the tribals. Tribals are smart, but, well, they're just sort of ignorant. Educating them will help them rectify that. Good. More research speed for them. Come on, guys, come try to kill us. Oh, more factories. Well, if we have more factories, go ahead and build some more uh, gun trucks if we can. Hopefully we won't be losing anywhere, but there's no guarantee, except death and taxes in life. And maybe playing a little bit of Old World Blues, or watching someone play Old World Blues. We'll see. Oh. Even the tiles that we cannot get to are still somewhat important. Maybe not the most important, but still somewhat important. Alright, so you guys are... Doing, are you literally all here? Are you anywhere else? No? Good. Help them out as well. Really hurt them. And by really hurt them, I mean cut them completely off. Nice. Logistics 5. Very bueno. Very bueno. Alright. Oh. A devastating loss for us. Oh, that is not good. Uh, everyone wants to be a convert. I knew it. And we cut these guys off from the capital. Oh, uh, almost. They still have Escantala Escalante. Sort of, yeah. What a shame. What a shame. Alright, so you get a good one. Go ahead, move in. Oh, where, where the heck were you guys? Just hanging out. Oh, okay, that's fine. Whatever. Happens. Cool. Keep going, guys. Keep going. You're doing a great job. Push them almost completely out. Help settlements. Oh, we can restore the state of Utah. Good. Gain scores on all Utah states. New Canaan will be known as a nation of God. We, if we have that, we have to do that, right? We have to. New Canaan becomes... Look at that flag. The Nation of God. Not even Deseret. Just the Nation of the Lord. A truly beautiful thing, my friends. A truly beautiful thing. Amazing. Look at that manpower now. Ooh. Vopus has nothing on the Nation of God. Nothing. No, we're not even Deseret. We're literally just the Nation of God, which is awesome. Uh, have you guys... Don't, don't be like that other general. That failure of a general. Please do not get encircled. Go down to history books is one of the worst disasters in New Canaanite Mormon history. Great interception, good. Good, you guys come over here. And we're going to push out to like here-ish, so that'll be good. Nice. 
Come on. Seven divisions, only seven? Six? How about we make it five? Five? How about five foot five dollar foot long? Ooh, Leonida. Sir Life Giver. That'd be good. Yes. Much like Christ, he shall be or an attempt to be a life giver. Go and help him out. Nice. You guys, get over here. At least we have a good base to operate from and just support. They haven't broken over here at all. Educate the tribals, and we shall do peacekeeping peacekeepers once more. We shall do our best to minister to Utah's spiritual needs and hold back increasing militancy. We are not the Legion, whatever our flaws. All we can do is try to ensure that, and when we die, we are well received by the Lord. Very, very good. Hmm. Yeah, I just don't think I, we have enough time to actually take out all the Legion here. They're still pretty strong. So the next episode, tomorrow's episode, might be actually a little bit shorter than normal. Maybe. But you know what? I guess we'll leave that here. Because we did break over to the rest of Arizona. Hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I will see you tomorrow when we will finish this campaign as the good nation of God. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.